Phil's Creepy Vids. Hey there, horror fans. It's your buddy Phil here, and I am back at you today with another video. Um, just going through the Blu-rays I've picked up recently. Uh, I like to let them stack up, do the video, and then I can kind of file them on my unit and uh, my shelving unit. And uh, so yeah, let's get down to it. First off, The Prodigy. I got this in a trade box from Brian Minnick. And uh, yeah, I liked it a lot. It's about an evil boy who is... Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Yeah, basically the mother loves the son that she's uh, adopted, but he turns out to be very evil. But uh, yeah, I really like this one, The Prodigy. I think it came out last year, so check it out if you can. Next we have Panic, also known as Satanic Panic. This also was in a trade box from Brian Minnick. And uh, I like this one too. It's about a pizza delivery girl who delivers pizza to a rich neighborhood. And the rich neighborhood are doing are like Satanists. Um, they need a virgin to sacrifice and the pizza delivery girl happens to be that virgin. Uh, I really like this one too. It has Jerry O'Connell in it. Uh, really like the slip cover, how it's kind of metallic. You get all the colors there and there's the back. So yeah, that's Panic, also known as Satanic Panic. So check that one out. Next we have Yoga Hosers. Uh, this is from Kevin Smith of Jay and Silent Bob fame. Uh, it is very Canadian. I got this from Brian as well, and uh, I really like this movie. It's very quirky and not for everyone, but uh, it's like part two of the Great Canadian North trilogy. Uh, the first one was Tusk. Second one is this one. Third one, I think, is called uh, Moose Jaws. So check it out if you are into that sort of thing. Next, Three from Hell. This is the 4K Blu-ray. Uh, Rob Zombie's End of the Trilogy, House of 1000 Corpses, Devil's Rejects, and now Three from Hell. Uh, not the best one of the bunch for me, but uh, glad to have it in my collection. This is the unrated version. And the art on the disc, or the case is the same as the slipcover. Also from Brian. Next, finally picks, picked up Alice Sweet Alice from Arrow. I was glad that I got the slipcover because I think the slipcover is now all sold out. Love the new artwork on there. Old artwork flipped on the cover. Comes with a whole whack of special features. Um, this movie is also known as Communion. It was Brooke Shields' first movie. Um, they marketed this as Brooke Shields being the star of the movie, even though she dies in the first like five or ten minutes. But uh, it's from Alfred Soule, and it's a classic in my opinion. Can't go wrong with Alice, Sweet Alice. So, uh, yeah, I think this is late 70s, 78, 79 maybe, if I'm not mistaken, but not too sure on that. Alice Sweet Alice, great slasher flick. Check it out if you have the chance. Next, I picked up The Prophecy. This is from Screen Factory. This is a cool mutant bear movie. Um, kind of like toxic waste going into the rivers, bears feeding on it, becoming kind of mutant bears. And there's uh, a whole thing with the... Uh, the native people protecting the forest and the deforestation people tearing it down. And then you have like mutant bears thrown into the mix. I really enjoyed this one. This is 80s horror at its best. Cheese. It says, she lives, don't move, don't breathe. There's no nowhere to run, she will find you. And that is Prophecy. The 
the monster movie. Next, we have the Blu-ray of Flesh Eating Mothers. This is a cheesy, low-budget 80s movie, I believe. Late 80s. Uh, do you have a date on here? No, we don't. But yeah, Flesh Eating Mothers. It's kind of like a mutant STD turns all the mothers into flesh eating mothers. And it's just, you know, comedic horror cheese. But I really like this one. So if you want to have a laugh, Flesh Eating Mothers. Just the title alone, like. Next, I got the Arrow box set of An American Werewolf in London. And it comes in a nice hard cased box. Has the old pentagram there. And it comes with a nice book booklet with three individual write-ups on the film. It also comes with a reversible poster, which I will show you quickly. The theatrical and then the newly commissioned art. So double-sided poster there. Pretty cool. So you got your book, your poster, and you got a Blu-ray, and it does come with a few extras here. I got a card for White, White Fang, White Fire, never heard of that. And then you have uh, six lobby cards, I believe. I'll go through these here real quick. Just the lobby cards from when the movie came out. Reproductions. Pretty cool. So, American Werewolf from Arrow. Nice big box set. Nice to finally add this to the collection. And that is an American Werewolf in London. Arrow box set. Very, very cool. Next, we have a scary movie. And no, this is not the, the comedy scary movie. This is the original scary movie. It is about a guy who goes to a carnival funhouse attraction on Halloween. Kind of gets locked inside with a killer, and it's like a whodunit, and people are dying, and you have to figure out who the killer is. This came out way back in 1991, but uh, yeah, very, very, very fun film uh, if you want a good time and like 90s cheese. This is a double disc. I believe it's Blu-ray and DVD. Yep. So yeah, that is Scary Movie, the original Scary Movie, and I wasn't even aware that there was a Scary Movie before the the comedy scary movie, but uh, yeah, this one's really good, so check it out if you have a chance. Last but not least, we have the collector's edition of The Blob with the newly commissioned cover art there. It says, Terror Has No Shape, and I did reverse to the original on the Blu-ray case just to have both artworks, and this comes with a whack of special features. And uh, this is obviously the remake of The Blob. Came out in the 90s, I believe. Uh, no, 1988, so late 80s. Comes with a new whack of special features from Scream Factory. And uh, making of, um, you know, like interviews, audio, new audio commentaries. Um, so yeah, The Blob Collector's Edition from Scream Factory. You have the new artwork there, which is just amazing. I really, really like that. And yeah, has the check from uh, Saw movies too. Uh, Shawnee, Shawnee uh, what's her name? Shawnee Smith, yeah. From the Saw movies. So yeah, the Blob remake. Check it out if you have a chance. 
Uh, so that's all I've picked up in the last little while. Now I can go throw them on the shelving unit and uh, kind of clear up some clutter that way. But uh, yeah, I hope everybody out there is having a great day. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't like this video, still hit the thumbs up button. And uh, if you're not subbed to my channel, uh, I'd love a subscription from you. So uh, hit the sub button, hit the bell notification, get uh, notified whenever I put out a new video. And uh, yeah, hope everybody out there is having a great day. Uh, that's my time. Thanks for yours. Have a good one, guys. Peace! So if you guys like that video, comment down below, hit the like button, subscribe, and we'll see you in Phil's next video. Peace!